So we're here with Steph, aka Vegan Babe, and this is Strongman Becomes a Vegan Babe for a Day. <laughs> Laws, I don't know why you put this in the program. Whoa. <laughs> so we're gonna make, what are we gonna do? We're gonna start and we're gonna make uh, tofu eggs. A tofu scramble, yeah, yeah. We'll make it like taste like eggs, make it look like eggs, tons of protein. Mm -hmm. And then maybe we'll do like some baking, mm -hmm. you know, some high protein muffins or cookies or something. It's all gonna be high protein because mm -hmm. you know, I know you eat like a million grams of protein a day. Mm -hmm. And then we're gonna take you for dinner. Beautiful. At a beautiful, high protein vegan restaurant. There's like seitan there. You're gonna love it. Awesome. You're gonna love it. So, we're taking this basic ass white block of tofu and we're gonna make it taste like eggs and look like eggs. So, we're gonna do that with primarily turmeric, which is for color. But they, you, people actually use it for like dyes for clothing and stuff. And then we're gonna use this black salt, which has like an eggy taste and flavor. So, you can literally like even smell it. Give it away. It literally smells like eggs. Almost like oh, rotten wow. eggs type of yeah. thing. So wow. one serving has 14 grams of protein, 130 calories, eight grams of fat, and three grams of carbs. What's a serving? How many? A grams? serving is 85 grams. This one is I think 500. Okay. No, 350. This is 350, so it's about I think three and a bit servings. Well, let's see where we can take it. So. So Mitch, how many of your subscribers do you think are vegan? <laughs> Zero. <laughs> uh. Zero. <laughs> Uh, well, I have 13.7. So definitely comment below if you Up are vegan. 13,000. There has to be one. All right. So it looks like scrambled eggs, right? We just put a little bit of soy milk. You can use like any plant milk that you want. Just to kind of like... You don't want it that's unsweetened. Yeah, unsweetened. And then we're going to add just a little bit of nutritional yeast. This is like vegan crack. It's like the best thing in the whole world. It's like cheesy. Oh wow. It's super, super cheesy. Yeah, that's nice. So you can make like mac and cheese yeah, with it. Yeah, it's all like crap there. Mm -hmm. It's literally like, yeah, it's so good. And it's really high in vitamin B12 and actually really high in protein as well. Nooch. Like really, really high. Like I think a quarter cup has like eight grams of protein. Oh wow. So now we're gonna add a little bit of turmeric. You don't want too much because yeah, it is very strong, <laughs> the smell. And then just a little bit of black, black salt for the eggy flavor. If well, you a have lot. to give, I guess, um, quantities, of each of these ingredients, what would you say they were like the soy milk and these, what would you say the quantities are? Uh, well, I just kind of like eyeball it always, but this was a whole block of tofu. I really just put a splash of soy milk and then the salt you're going to want to put a lot of, probably like a quarter teaspoon to a half a teaspoon, just a pinch of turmeric. And the nutritional yeast isn't really necessary. I just like it because it adds like a little bit of a cheesy flavor. So maybe like one to two tablespoons of that. So to get it even more eggy, sometimes I will actually blend up tofu with water. So it's kind of like a, it's just like a thick liquid consistency and I'll mix it in. So it'll be even more like- Runny? Yeah, more runny. How do you factor in the complete pain in the ass that it is to like figure out what you're gonna eat? Cause even when- mm, Like going those, out? Those of us who have all the options available to mm -hmm. us, we'll sit at home and go like, well, I don't know what I'm gonna eat tonight. And then you take away what the staple of a lot of people's meals mm -hmm. are. That must be that must have been a disaster. At like first. at the beginning, my meals were just like mush. I didn't know what I was. I was just doing like stir fries. I didn't know how to cook vegan food, so it was all like yeah. trash. But in the long run, like, like, anything that is worth doing is going to take a little bit of time. Yeah. You know, to master, you have to learn new skills. But now, like having learned all those skills, I actually have so much more to play with. Like there's 20,000 edible plants on this planet. You know what I mean? Compared to how many meats are there? Like 10, like that people eat on a regular yeah. basis. Yeah. So now I have all these different ingredients that I can play with and put together in different ways. Like I yeah. just explored a little bit more. So for me, it's not like, obviously I cook a lot, so it's not hard at all. Yeah. The only thing yeah. that's hard sometimes is like going out to eat. Sure. Because a lot of places aren't very vegan friendly, but if that's the case, I just have like sides. I'll just have like potatoes and like vegetables. Yeah. I'll eat before, yeah, have a protein yeah. shake. Yeah. Or I just won't go. Like if it's like a horrific place where I'm gonna have nothing to eat, like I don't want to go there and then just like not yeah, yeah, of course. sit there and have like a fucking salad or something. 
Oh, wow. You can taste this guy. Mm-hmm. The newts. Yeah, that's not necessary. I just like the flavor of it, so. That's it. good. That's really good. So, I would hazard that this is this is actually better than standard eggs. Wow. Yeah, and I don't really lie. Lying is not my thing. Wow. But that's actually pretty tolerable. All right, we got quite a bit, and you're eating it out of the frying pan with the spoon. Yeah, not that much. You, that would take you 20 minutes, 25. I'm a slow eater. All right, you ready? Count them down. Three, two, one, go. I feel like he's almost done already. One bite. I gave him a big boy spoon. Yeah. It's so tolerable, that's the thing. I have to eat eggs really so because it roast. Oh, that's yeah. Thank God. <laughs> Time. Like that. Hate. We missed the mark, but we got chatting. We were chatting, right. yeah. yeah. So we'll go grocery store, see what shopping like a vegan is like. Then we're going to go to a gym, see what exercising like a vegan babe is like. Then we're going to have some dessert, some post-workout dessert. See, I envision shopping as a vegan as like 90% here. Oh, it's all on the outsides. We yeah. don't go in the inside. Yeah, which is a shame. And as a vegan, you have to have grocery bags for your Oh, vegetables. true. It's yeah, there's a like, whole other side to it. It's a requirement. Plastic, though. Is plastic not vegan? No, it's vegan. It's just like environmentally friendly. Right, okay. Like a lot of people go vegan to be environmentally friendly. Like, what's yeah. their impacts over? That's a whole procedure. And then these are all of the moth meats. These wings, you know, these are the cauliflower wings. There's like really good wings. These are really good burgers. Now, you wouldn't conflate veganism with, with being healthy per mm. se. No, 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 no. Yeah. A lot of people think that like, if you're a vegan, you're automatically healthy, but this is all vegan. French fries are vegan. Yeah. yeah, it's all crap. Yeah. Oreos are vegan. Oreos, Oreos are, vegan. are vegan, yeah. Disgusting. There's like junk food vegan, and then there's people who do it for like the animals who like don't really care what they eat, and then there's people who are more health conscious and yeah. eat more like whole foods, plant-based, which is gonna be the cheapest as well. So we're making chickpea cookies. Cookies out of chickpeas, high protein. They are drugs. So chickpeas, what else? What chickpeas, else goes into Chickpeas, maple syrup, okay. and then peanut butter, yeah. baking powder, baking soda, which I already have, and chocolate chips, which I already have. Cool. So we just need the peanut butter and the maple syrup. What is that? What do you mean sugar? There's what one gram this? of sugar. That's beautiful. Look at the ingredients. Smooth. Peanuts, sugar, oil, salt, just, hydrogenated just... vegetable oil, rapeseed oil, mono and diglycerides. It's trash. You couldn't tell what me what half garbage? of that is. You also started, <laughs> I, like, I like how you look at the label. You go, look at this label, peanuts. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but all the other stuff. Look at this one, peanuts and salt. Wow. That's what we want to see. Okay, beautiful. That's it. Here all we right. go. Good. Thanks. And the maple syrup. You're teaching me how to be a vegan, not how to be an adult. <laughs> <laughs> I'm teaching you how to be a healthy vegan, okay? Okay. <laughs> I don't want you being a junk food vegan. Sorry, what did you just put in here? Maple just to be syrup. clear, as you're spouting about being healthy. Maple syrup. Beautiful. How's the sugar in this? It's very sugary. <laughs> so you save the sugary. sugar from the peanut butter. Yeah, but that's and then like the add it back in. There's all the chemicals and stuff in there. We don't want that. <laughs> we want to know exactly what's going in. All right. All right. And that's a wrap. Um, so we're here. And um, we're going to do a little leg work there today. Yeah, Booty what's focus. <laughs> what's that? Booty focus. Booty focus leg work. <laughs> Always. Of course. Vegan focus. Yes, yeah, a vegan, vegan workout. It's definitely a vegan <laughs> workout. So she can't hurt the moose too much. <laughs> or else it would be animal cruelty. Let's warm up those glutes. Okay, crab walks? Crab walks. These ones? How far we go? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What are we starting with? Go all the way down. All the way down? Yeah. Down and back. <laughs> oh, 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 yeah. What do you mean? Nice with this guy? Okay. What is this? Go lower. <laughs> oh, I have hip bursitis from my squats the other day. These are two very different looking crab walks. <laughs> I want to hear your excuses. You know, my hips are hurting. One is fueled by I'm going to pop that booty back. <laughs> How much resistance is this black That's engine? like the heaviest one. I can't well, even it do literally, that. It literally like stops. It looks like it's going to snap. Oof. <laughs> <sighs> All right. Okay. Oh. This is the key to oh. a big deadlift. Oh. Oh. Warming up those glutes. Oh, on fire. I'm actually going to be so as shit after today. <laughs> I can't... It's a different type of burn. Oh, oh, oh. Nice. 
Oh, oh, that's actually so full on. Oh, you don't look like you're struggling as much. No, I'm chilling. But she's well, got that's the nothing bit. One. She's. Yeah, this is full on, full on. All right. We'll do 15 on each side. Or no, we'll do 10, and then we'll do 10 pulses. Seven, ten pulses. Eight, yeah, nine, ten, and then ten pulses. <laughs> Should we send this to Laws? Training hard. Hi, sweetie. All right. <laughs> Next leg. <sighs> ten. Mitch, your leg isn't going back nearly as far. <laughs> no, it's a different band. No, I know. Yeah. Okay, not ten pulses. <laughs> <laughs> my, the regulars are my pulses. We should have given you the other band, maybe. Oh. All right. Whew. Pulses complete. Glute activation complete. Actually, <laughs> are you watching, sweetie? <laughs> oh my god. Right. <laughs> 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 Thank you. Did most of work there. Uh, right after I went vegan, so like six and a half years. Yeah, so all vegan muscle, baby. Oh, so you weren't exercising before you went vegan either? No. Oh, wow. Yeah, I started afterwards. So, so it was a whole lifestyle change. Yeah, well, like, I always tried to do exercises, but I would do, like, home workout videos, yeah, like, yeah. like, a Jane Fonda. Like, yeah. <laughs> and then I just, like, didn't, didn't stick with anything. And then once I found weightlifting, I was obsessed. Right. Wow, that's nice, Mitch. You want to say any kind words to Ashley? Feel the Where burn. are we at right now? We're at 50, 90, 45, 135. We're at 155. Ashley, if you hit a bulk, we're safe. <laughs> Still look straight forward. What's that? Chin tucked. Oh, chin tucked? Yeah, chin tucked and looking forward. Oh, that's A nice. man doing the pulses doesn't, it feels a bit full on. You're looking great. Oh. I can't take this serious. <laughs> do you ever do hip thrusts? No. You never do See, hip also, it's funny because, like, when you say tuck your chin, you have room to tuck your chin. I know. Well, I, there's not much there for me. <laughs> so, what are we doing next, Mitch? We're, We're going to do one weight. set the weight of an average strong man, which is probably like 360. Just to see, could I swing the other way from a physical capacity point? <laughs> <laughs> Would you like to say anything to any strong men while you're doing this? Anyone specific come to mind? <laughs> Mostly just Rano. And for Rob, for obvious reasons. <laughs> Nice. This is like, makes you feel so vulnerable. <laughs> <laughs> like I need a blocker. You wrap your sweater around. Hope we don't need a toque. <laughs> it's actually, I actually like it more than I thought it would. Yeah? yeah. New favorite What's exercise. The what do you think about this thing? What do I think about it? Yeah. If I ever hurt my back, I would probably go to this. Yeah. Oh, interesting. That is actually nice. This, <laughs> this angle is brought to you by Tear. <laughs> I like to lean forward. Oh, lean forward. <laughs> That's the one. Laws, I don't know why you put this in the progress. Whoa. <laughs> well, that was Booty Workout with Vegan Bit. Thank you very much. You're welcome. We're going to head it. back and we're going to bake some chickpea cookies. Well, first, 
we gotta go get some yeah. gift card. Yeah, KFC. we're gonna we're gonna go get some vegan lunch at KFC, which apparently has a vegan option. Oh wow, how good! And then uh, we'll bake some cookies. Then we're going out for dinner. Yeah, where are we going for dinner? Somewhere here, right? Yeah, very. It's uh, called Valiance, local. Lots of high protein stuff. Beautiful. Awesome. Well, well done. You too. On to the next. <laughs> On to the next. Now All we're right. gonna go teach him the booty pose. The booty pose. All right. So you put one foot planted firmly on the floor. Yeah. The other one behind. Uh -huh. And then you squeeze that butt cheek. The back one? Squeeze your, yeah, the back one. Yeah. Squeeze it so it kind of pops up. Mm -hmm. And then you tighten your abs and then twist and twist your upper body. Oh, that fucker has her back. There. That's it. There you go. Mm. Where'd you go? Rana. Hey, Rana. <laughs> <laughs> that's it. Wow. Booty Beautiful. pose. That's nice. <laughs> Love it. Mastered. I don't know what it's called. It's called like the vegan chicken. Thanks for choosing KFC Taco Bell. How may we help you today? Hello. Do you want one? Hi. Yes. So two? Can we have? You have one yet? I'm okay. Oh, can we have uh, two vegan uh, sandwiches, please? Two bacon famous chicken sandwiches. No, the, pla the plant-based. The plant-based the plant -based sandwiches. Plant-based. Yeah. Okay. Spicy or regular? Spicy. No, With one regular. One spicy. One and spicy. one spicy. Are they in the combos or on their own? On their own is okay. Okay. Your nutrition right there. Okay. It's looking pretty real. It's looking pretty chickeny. Yeah. Yeah, I don't see any issues. Okay, first bite, first impression. Oh wow. Look at that. That's good? Mmm. What do you think, Mitch? Could you go vegan? <laughs> Based on the two. The vegan food so base far. at so far, the vegan food is basically tasting like regular food. So, <laughs> yeah, I could go vegan without really noticing, is what I'm learning. <laughs> That's nice. Yeah? Yeah. What would you rate it on a scale of 1 to 10? Like, probably an 8. Oh, wow. Really? Uh -huh. It's good. All right, what are we making here? What? We're making cookies. Cookies, but we're making them out of chickpeas. Okay. So you'll never know. Chickpeas. So they're high in protein, high in fiber, your favorite, and they just taste freaking <laughs> delicious. Beauty. And you feel great after eating them. They're just the best. We make these like multiple times a week. Yeah, I have the chocolate chips. <laughs> well, there's gonna be tons of those in there, so it's perfect. All right, so chickpeas into the blender, whole can of chickpeas, and then half a cup of peanut butter, and a third a cup of maple syrup. And the dogs can have it? Yeah, of course. Peanut butters. Peanut butters for the pepperonis. And just a little bit of vanilla. And then we're just gonna blend that up till it's smooth and then add our baking powder and baking soda. What do you think? Less ingredients than most. Convenience is going hot. I don't see how this is gonna make a batter, but I look forward to seeing it. You gotta trust the process. It takes a little bit of perseverance and a high-speed blender. <laughs> That's really surprising, actually. Smells like a cookie. Yeah, the chickpea mixed with the maple syrup, it smells like it should. And the baking soda. The baking what is soda. That? It's a bougie spoon. Are you kidding? <laughs> <laughs> Unicorn. Oh, wow. Look at that. That's nice. Beautiful. Wow, thank you. I got you one as well. Oh, perfect. The seashell. Is, oh, man, the seashell. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. It's different, but it's close enough. Mm. And considering like how healthy it is, you know. He's like, we don't need one. <laughs> we don't need to bake these. Yeah, no, that's good. I just eat them like that. That's my favorite way. So the whole thing is 1,400 calories, 91 grams of fat, 196 carbs, and just about 55 grams of protein. Wow. So, surely you just what? You just kind of plop it? Yeah, just scoop it. Yeah, you don't mind? We use our spoons. You know, that's it. I just kind of put it down and then mold it. Okay, what bottom or top? Not bottom. So what is this? What are the macros on this guy here? Cool. Uh, 310 calories, 17 grams of fat, 37 grams of carbs, 
three grams of protein. Oh. Moral of the story, you need to eat a lot of this to get protein. Yeah, that is not very uh, pro protein. Yeah, this is not high protein. It's just delicious. Nice though. Yeah. So delicious. Do you like ice cream or frozen yogurt? Ice cream. Ice cream? Mm. Mm. Custard, ice cream, frozen yogurt. Okay. Mm. And where does this fit in the cut? With ice cream. Like, same, same. Okay. Yeah. Wow. Right. Let's see. Texture wise? Well, they're really soft. Yeah, I think we undercooked them a little bit, but it'll yeah. still taste good. Yeah. Just gonna have to go for it. I mean, seeing how we are eating the batter, <laughs> I'm assuming they taste good. Like, exactly. Mm -hmm. Do you like the batter or the cookies better? Well,. The cookies are just like hot batter. Yeah, I think they should have been cooked a little bit they more. Because <laughs> we forgot to set a time. Yeah, you're right. They're not cooked at all. We forgot to set a timer, so I just kind of eyeballed it and then. Not much of a problem for me though. How okay. long would you bake these though, Steph? So that way, I could just add to the video. 18, 19 minutes. 18, 19 minutes. Yeah, these are not cooked enough. But... Yeah, cooked enough. <laughs> Doesn't seem. That's all right. <laughs> so we're gonna hang out for a bit, and then we're going out for dinner. Mm-hmm. Downtown Barry. Mm-hmm. All right, well, I'll see you guys there. We're here at Valley. It's a uh, vegan restaurant here in Barrie. We are wrapping up our day of eating by getting a bunch of food that, um, as per everything else today, is mimicking um, regular food. These are made from seitan, which is something, for, it's called vital wheat gluten. It's basically like the protein extracted from flour. So this is like straight protein. I'm gonna give a quick assessment just on the aesthetics of the food at the moment. If you wanna pan over, I'm impressed by these guys. They look nice. Yeah, yeah we got some more coming here. We got some oh, yeah. ribs too. Yeah, we got some Sticky ribs. ribs. Those also look nice. Yeah, those look These are ribs. looking like someone puked on. Well, this one's like a garlic parmesan. Yeah, like yeah. we'll see how it tastes. Sausage that yeah. not been cooked. Yeah. yeah <laughs> I think it's the, it's the sauce. Are these are insane. Oh All right, so we'll see how it goes. Um, Let's but the beach. I want to see. Getting well fed today. So which one's this? What what flavor is this? Stranger Things. Stranger Things. Stranger Things. Things. I don't know. It's like a Stranger it's like a wings. it's got a spice to it. Yeah, so like a little bit of spiciness, spicy? maybe like. Mister <laughs> doesn't like spices. Oh so fuck. Oh yeah. really? <laughs> That's too much. It's hot. Yeah. Mmm. What does it taste like? Mm. Besides Are hot. Are you dying? You don't like the spice, eh? Um no. <laughs> <laughs> it's um chewy. The assessment. Better or worse? Exterior, much better. Yeah. Better? Better. Do you think it was just because of the spice? No. That's because there's substance in the middle. The saute? Mm hmm. Seitan. Seitan. It, it really needs a lot of something else to make it taste good. It's more like spongy. Because it's so nothing. It's mm -hmm. like eating a sponge. Yeah, well, it's uh, it by itself is very flavorless. Like you have to add a lot yeah. to it to give it a flavor. Yeah, so that is better because that's more overpowering. I think that one's spicy without a lot of flavor. They love seitan here. They yeah. love seitan here. They are it's hard, it's an hard for making it. It's like so making hard, it's yeah. So difficult. Some would say they are seitan worshipers. <laughs> 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 I just knew you had something to say when I just saw you over there. <laughs> Aesthetics on this one are better. Yeah, that one looks more like a rib. But it's the same seitan. It's a little bit different, the texture. Very different. Mm, that's interesting. Okay. I think he likes it. That's better. Right Not here. better. That's the best of the three? If you were to rate all these three starters? If, today, yes. If I ate them ten times, those would be better. Yeah. If I got used to those, they'd be better. It's the texture? Do you yeah. Think? There's no getting used to those. <laughs> <laughs> this is a black bean patty. Mm -hmm. Thank you. 
It tastes like a healthy sandwich. <laughs> it doesn't give you the like. Mm -hmm. It doesn't give you the same as a burger, but you certainly feel better about eating it. <laughs> that's my synopsis on this one. Yeah, that's the black bean patty. Yeah. So that's like a whole food patty. Uh huh. Uh huh. Which is what I went for. The Beyond Meat ones, I've had those before. They're, so they're really good. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, what do we All got right. here? This is a Canadian Philly, man. I got chicken, um, bacon bits, some mushroom, onions, and a, a cheese sauce that's turmeric based. So, what do they use to substitute all that stuff? Well, the chicken is seitan. Yeah. So, that's seitan. Got vegan mayo. The, the, the cheese sauce, like I said, is based off of turmeric. I think the bacon is based out of coconut. Like coconut, yeah. Mm hmm. They season it and salt it. And you got a bun, man. Pretty simple. So, how does That's this awesome. meal compare to the others that you've had today? Well, uh, KFC, really good. Filled with scramble? Eggs. Eggs were just like eggs. Like, Eggs are never anything to get excited about, but I would have those, for sure. This is least tasty, but probably best nutritionally in this category. Like the tofu scramble is probably the best nutritionally, but like KFC was just a deep fried mm. piece of whatever it was, which was nice, but. Yeah, then this is like, you're having a healthy sandwich. Yeah, a little yeah. bit healthier takeout. Yeah. Does that give you the answer you're looking for, Fabio? That's YouTubers. Can I get to, can I get to uh, eating now? I'll, I'll <laughs> be right into the mic for you. Yeah, against the, against the Give the people what they want. <laughs> it's been a day living like a vegan. It's been real. How oh, good. So, so we did scrambled eggs, we did cookies, ice cream, we did chicken burger, regular burger, chicken wings. I think the biggest thing that you want to pass on to people is that vegan isn't you are or you aren't. You can make some choices, have a little bit less meat. No, <laughs> that's not what vegan is. Vegan is no, 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 no. yes or no, but my <laughs> message is that you should try and reduce as much as you can. Because that's going to make a big impact if everybody does that. But to paraphrase, <laughs> any impact, oh my God. any change makes an impact. Of course, every yeah. little change helps. So there are some really good options. I, I think seriously that, that cookie dough, I'm going mm. to do myself. So good. The scramble is possible if you get actually onto the, um, the spices. Um, but good to know. You can eat like a vegan as a strongman. And I mean, I'm getting heaps of food, heaps of protein. That's really not a concern today. So there you go. Thank you very much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, become a member. And uh, <laughs> if you be kind, we'll see you later.